Good morning, dogs, and welcome back to the announcements. Yesterday, sadly, we weren't able to bring in the news because of our short classes yesterday. Even though our stories are a bit delayed, we'll give you the scoop right after the pledge. Please stand. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. After an extremely difficult match for dodgeball yesterday, 2-1 to one odds had lost to the Dodgers. Well, with all the hype behind it, it's no surprise that the Dodgers won. And with the team being entirely made of seniors, I hope they can look back at this high note as they graduate to their lives after high school. Students who are unable to get lunch over the summer, there will be a summer food program to, for ages 18 and below, offering lunches Monday through Friday. It will be available at the Frankfurt High School, Suncrest, Circle Park, Boys and Girls Club, Prairie Creek Park, Healthy Communities, and at El Camino. For details, you can find a link in the chatter. Now, to sports and weather. Good morning, dogs. Tonight, the baseball team travels today to face the Warriors. Game starts at 6. Then tomorrow morning, the baseball team is here at home against Hamilton Heights. The first game begins at 10 a.m. Then the second game will be played at 12 p.m. Best of luck to the baseball team. Last night, the softball team traveled to Danville. Where the Lady Dogs fell to the Danville Warriors 3-14. This puts the Lady Dogs... 4 and 10 in the conference and 8 and 13 overall. The girls are back in action for sectionals Tuesday, the 24th. Last night, the boys track team placed 5th out of 12 teams in the West Lafayette sectional. Congrats to go out to Logan Willis, 3rd in the long jump, and Aiden Hudspeth, 3rd in the pole vault. They will be advancing to regionals. Other point scorers include Sam Michael, 5th in the 100 meter dash, Mar Lopez, 6th in the 400, Greg Burge, 6th in the 300 hurdles. Angel Perez, Jordan Henderson, Greg Burge, Mar Lopez, 6th in the 4x4, Jacob Burns, 8th in the discus, and Edwin Winscott, 5th in the pole vault. Good job to them. The girls' tennis team had sectionals last night as well. Lady Hot Dogs ended their season falling in 11 and 0 and 5. That's all for sports. Now to Eli. Good morning, dogs. Coming in school day, it was 65 degrees, which was low. There will be winding conditions starting around 10 this morning and last throughout the day. The high will hit 84 at 4 this evening and stay away for a few hours. On Saturday, I expect thunderstorms. On Sunday, it should be cloudy. That's it for weather. Now back to your weird hosts. The Purdue Extension Office is education after high school from July 11th to July 15th. The deadline to apply is June 23rd. If you have any questions to apply, you can check in the chatter. A happy late birthday goes out to Christo Guzman. We hope you had a great birthday yesterday, but today we have no birthdays, unfortunately. To all juniors and senior girls, if you want to apply for the Clinton County Queen Pageant, you can find a link in the email that was sent to you. Good luck to all those pageants that apply. For lunch today, lines 1 and 2 is round pizza and lines 3 and 4, hot ham and cheese. That is all for the announcements. Make sure to like, share, and subscribe and hit that bell for more notifications. Have a good weekend, dogs. Also, a huge shout-out goes to Cohen and Austin for being cool people.